A FORMER ACCOUNTANT PLEADS GUILTY TO STEALING MORE THAN A MILLION DOLLARS FROM THE ABBEY OF GETHSEMANE. JOHN HUTCHINS ADMITS USING THE MONEY TO PAY FOR CARS AND EXPENSIVE TRIPS. STEVE BERGEN JOINS US NOW WITH WHAT HAPPENED TODAY IN NELSON COUNTY CIRCUIT COURT. STEVE. Thank you, Rick. Both John Hutchins and his wife Carrie were named in a multi count indictment earlier this year. The thefts of monastery funds occurred over a five year period. The Abbey of the Gethsemane sets in a serene section of Nelson County, a place where Trappist monks live and pray, and when they aren't praying, making cheese, fruitcakes, and fudge to generate income for the monastery. In February, the Abbey discovered a trusted employee, John Hutchins, have been embezzling its money. His wife Carrie was named as a co-conspirator. One of the Abbey personnel just got a found a discrepancy, and then uh, once he started looking into it, he noticed that it was quite extensive. That's when we were called. The Hutchins live here near the monastery. As part of their plea agreement, they must forfeit the home, two vehicles, big screen televisions, appliances, computers, even their lawnmower, along with forty-two thousand dollars in cash. In addition, that you pay the sum of $600,000 in restitution jointly and severally to the Abbey of Gethsemane. Authorities say the couple used their ill gotten gains to buy big ticket items and expensive trips. The, the sentence is 20 year sentence, which is the maximum uh, under state law that can be given for Class D and Class C felonies. That's what John Hutchins is facing. His wife Carrie was given a one year sentence. Probated for two years. Do you think that the restitution will ever be paid in that amount? Um, that's a good question. That is a good question, considering the fact it's six hundred thousand dollars, and the couple has only been ordered to pay back one hundred dollars a month. Steve Bergen, WLKY News. Thank you, Steve. John Hutchins will be formally sentenced in December. Prosecutors say they will oppose any kind of probation.